couch potatoes. So you know what I feel? I found out through a new episode. We're starting it, whatever, blah. Um, especially through playing Dark Souls. Mm-hmm. We, I think we want to do like a movie podcast. Like we always start talking about yeah. movies and TV shows. Well, dude. we consume a lot of media. It's true. It's true. I wish we had the standing to do a podcast. That is a fake chest. It's not. It's nope. not even though. It's not. Isn't it nice to know like how to tell yeah. from far away? Like, it makes you feel like you're a pro, <laughs> even though I'm obviously not. <laughs> well, you laughed at that. You couldn't even get that out. I couldn't. Um, what does that say? Storage, almost full. That, don't worry about that. Done. Okay. Um, what was, besides the... Movie podcast? Besides that. Oh, I mean, hey, if you want, if you want like, a podcast, that's a, that's a fake, that's, that's a, a fake one. You, you fuck him up. Oh, I got really into that. I pointed and everything. I like bowed up. And mm-hmm. My chest was puffed out like nice, a lizard. Dude. Oh, he's still alive. <laughs> I just staggered him. Oh dear, he's not dead. <laughs> oh dearie me, sir, you've given me quite a frighten. I don't. You stop it. I like that I joke. Hate those. I hate them. I hate them. I don't know why. I don't know why. It's, it's just... not even the. Oh, everyone loves <gasps> them, so I hate crystal ember. I, don't know what that I can means. make crystal weapons. You got so now. excited. I don't know what that meant. Anyway, it's not even one of those, like, oh, everyone loves them, so I hate them. It's just something about it. Oh, I found the key to open the the thing. (laughs) I found the thing to open the place. (laughs) Now I can go to the where and do the what? Yes. All right, let's see. Anyway, when you say it like that, you save the bigger movie, the bigger villain for the second movie. Mm -hmm. Doomsday makes sense. The problem is, this didn't feel like the second movie. This felt like the setup Dude. for a new set of movies. And Doomsday, while he is a Superman villain, mm-hmm. I feel like he's more of a Justice League thing. Like Darkseid? Yeah, I would not call Doomsday a the big Superman villain. I think that's Lex Luthor. I agree. Because here's the thing, and I have always said this from day one, so don't fucking tell me I'm just giving in to whatever. <laughs> Lex Luthor is human. He has human interests all the time. That is his thing. He sees Superman as an alien invader who has power that could potentially corrupt him. Mm -hmm. And Lex Luthor himself is corrupted by his own humanistic ideologies. And his own power because he's a fucking mogul. Um, But, I mean, that's why they're so good because it's not that Lex Luthor is evil and Superman is good. Because they're both complicated characters. No, they're just both different kinds of righteous, I suppose. Lex Luthor is human. Superman is not. Mm-hmm. That is why they are enemies. It's not because Lex Luthor doesn't like people doing good things. Well, that's the thing. The reason I don't like Superman slash Captain America because I think this similar this thing is similar between the two. Mm-hmm. They have this warped sense of it's not even warped. It's just this overhaul sense of self righteousness. Yeah, well, that drives me insane. If you aren't abiding by my rules of good, you're bad. And that pisses me off about both of those characters. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because it's it's one of those things where, like, it's like a Donald Trump syndrome. You know what I mean? It's you a, don't agree yeah. with me, so you're wrong. Except it's it's Superman, so you're on his side. It's a you're not with me, you're against me. Exactly. Thing. It's And it just, oh, God, it annoys me so don't much. You even do that, friend. You know I'm not going to let you. And that being said, Lex Luthor is the same. Yeah. He's just our mascot exactly for that. you know he's the human's mascot one thing i'll say is batman superman definitely painted both of the not you just took that right to the jaw yeah, yeah. definitely p- painted both the characters in a you know negative light yeah both of them are assholes in their own kind of way yeah well i mean that's and the I, thing. I liked that i want to see superman have a mental breakdown Honestly. Well, he had that in Man of Steel when he killed Zod. Uh, he didn't. Spoiler, but not really. I right. Can go watch the movie. He didn't. Uh, I, he could have been worse about it. The mental breakdown, you mean like in, in Injustice? When he kills the Joker and becomes a tyrannical dictator and raises the new neo-Nazi army? No, just like <laughs> just like an actual... Can I break this? Yes. yes. Because I'm not going, going around yeah. is way too much work. <laughs> I don't care, this isn't my place. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna um, go ahead and say that Dark Souls is our movie podcast. And if you don't like it... Where did... I'm sorry. Someone just yeah, hit me is, with what an What was arrow? that? 
Someone just fucking hit Did me someone with an immediately arrow. respawn and shoot you as soon as you uh No, I think the arrow was coming midway. Weird. Alright, humanity restored, here's what I'm gonna do. Mm hmm This refills five Astus flasks. I am going to use three humanities so that I can kindle this bonfire uh three times so that it can refill my Estus flask to twenty sips. Jeez. Yeah. That's five each time? Yep. It wow. refills it it makes it get stronger five each time. So let's see. Kindle. Cause you remember we killed the necromancer guy. Yes. And we got the right of kindling he stole from Yes. Um Skelly Dude, Jack Skellington. Right? Yeah. Yep. Alright. Whatever. Um, I could also probably take this time to go free Big Hat Logan, but that's a lot of... It's a long way, dude. It is. I'm gonna do that in between episodes. Yeah. Depending on what you do next, that is. Yeah. Alright, and we have enough souls to where I think I can... Where is it? Reinforce weapon? I think I can reinforce the Dragon Greatsword. Yep. 468, dude. It's pretty intense. I wonder if this will be good against Seath. Because he doesn't have scales. Mm, that's that's interesting. Do it's you a, have to fight him again? It's, yes, I do, but there's a way. All right, this is a staircase. How do I... Uh, Maybe that lever? <laughs> Wrong weird. lever! Nice. Thank you. It looks like there's something under... Oh. I thought it was gonna go up. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's no way you could have known. Yeah. I was looking for the secret. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, there's a little secret over here. It looks like there was a thing underneath that staircase, like moving around. It might have just been a shadow. It was a shadow. Uh, it may have been a shadow. There's a chest right here. That's safe. Yeah. All right. So for those of you who don't know, who may have skipped a couple of episodes if the chest has a circular uh a rounded kind of chain then it's a regular chest oh, but right. if the chain is straight then that is a mimic it's and you need to attack mag. them yeah yeah whoa yeah i ran right oh well it's not that far of a fall it looked no. like it was falling into the abyss all right now let's but it's just one see. texture of grass patterned over itself 30 times got it these guys are not tough, but they just hit hard. Yeah, no, no, no. And you, you don't want to stay in close because they no. yeah. just wreck your shit. Also, there's one part up here where there's there are like one. three of them, and you have to lure them very carefully one by one. Well, that was just like the Hydra. Yeah. When you were by the Hydra and there was like four of them. I mean, if if you get more than one just up in your little... Up in your little area. Right up Ooh, in your crack. Yeah, you're gonna have a bad time. Right up in the crevice. <laughs> my back, my back, my pussy, and my crack. What? You never heard that song? No, before? I have not. Mm, you're not no, missing sir. out. You're not missing out. <laughs> I don't know any more of that song. Anything? I just remember that. All right. I, I remember right. it because I think it was like on a CD that one of my parents was listening to at the time. Probably my dad because he's the DJ one. Oh and yeah. That line came on. He was like, next. Because <laughs> yep. I was very young. That's the only reason I remember that. Whoa! Yeah, right? That was cool, dude. i never seen that. Is he gonna do it again? Oh, nice. Dude, I wish I could make things. What do you mean? Like that. Like, just like... Oh. Just make things. You mean like... Magically. M yeah. Not like craftsmanly. What... We've talked about it personally, but your superpower you would want is still telekinesis? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. I, I still want stretchy powers. You want stretchy dog. Yeah, dude. Because let me tell you, that Jake the dog appeal, I love it. Also, dude, Mr. Fantastic, I don't know if you know all of his powers. He's lame. The guy can literally stretch his brain lame. to make him more knowledgeable. That... Chase? Yeah, what? That's the stupidest thing I've ever <laughs> heard. Dude, come on. That's, that's not how learning That's classic works. golden age... Con well, actually, I mean... What? If you do what? All right. Do what? Scientifically, mm -hmm. if you have more folds in your brain, mm -hmm. you have more surface area, right? Which means you have more neurons. Okay. And neurons are what make the connection to where you can. Uh... Whoa. Right. 
dude. Neurons are what lets you make the connection to where you can, uh, you know, process knowledge. Yeah, but here's the thing. He's not creating more. He's just expanding the thing he already has. Right. But if you're making more folds, then they just make... All right. No, I, no, no. I see what you're saying. That's not how that works. That wouldn't be how that works. But it's like a limited amount of Play-Doh. You can't make... As much as you stretch the Play-Doh, you can't make there be more of it. True. Yeah. All right. All right. I see there what you you're saying. I see what you're saying. Good way of putting it. Um, for the folks at home. So, Jamie, that's what this level is going to be, is going to be looking for invisible... What was that? Oh, something was moving down there. Is that the dragon? Are you above the dragon? No. That's a moonlight butterfly. We fought one before. Wasn't it like a boss before? It, well, yeah, but... <laughs> oh, trust me, Jamie. We're going to get to an area after this where there are bosses that are regular enemies now. Um, I'm on the fence about when games do that. Well, here's the thing. It has to be done right. You know what I mean? We God of are... War does it... See, again, it's another one I'm on the fence about. I don't know yeah. if they do it right or not. Because there's a part where you get in, like, there's parts where you get to it, and you're like, here's an ogre. It has to be done where it's natural progression. Yeah. Well, that's the thing, Jamie. We are super strong. Like, exactly. We fought these guys yeah. when we were level one babies. I feel like Dark Souls will do it right. God of War does it wrong. You, mm -hmm. fight, a, you fight an ogre, and it's like boss-style ogre, and he's super strong. And also, then you come back, and there's weaker versions of the same exact boss to make you feel stronger when you're not. I don't like that. Go on. Um, also, one of the things about the bosses is the arenas. That's true. Um, because when when we get to, like, see how these are just kind of left everywhere? Whereas when it was a boss, we only had a bridge to move on. Yeah. Dude, I don't know where the fuck... Well, you know what you can do? Go to the next episode. Find out on the next episode, All Jace. Right. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Do you want to find out now or something? Oh, I just dropped down here. Oh, my God. I was going to say that. All right, here we are.